Each week we take time on our home church services to talk about generosity, how we can steward the resources that God has given us through avenues like tithe and offering to fuel God's mission of being disciples and make more disciples. And in the message today, our big idea centers around the idea of humble obedience. In, in Matthew chapter 3, uh, we see both Jesus and, the John, and John the Baptist uh, step out in humble obedience. And I believe God is honored when we choose to obey, when we choose to, to love him in that way. Jesus, in fact, said in John 14, he says, if you love me, obey what I've commanded. So that's what we strive to do as followers of Jesus, to obey his leading, to, to pursue life in his kingdom, his kingdom mission and his kingdom values. And generosity is one of those steps of obedience. I mean, if you've ever spent time around little kids, uh, you know, our, our natural operating system as human beings is not to be generous. It's to take, it's to hold, it's not to be freely giving of. But that's the beauty of what Jesus has done for us. You see, God's generosity to us is what fuels and inspires and motivates and animates our generosity back. You see, God was the one who took the first step of generosity in giving his son and giving us the life that we have, the, the breath that we breathe. All that we have comes from him. And so in response, in obedience, we give back. We are generous to God, to his mission. Again, as I said earlier, our faithful giving fuels God's mission. So I just want to say thank you for the ways that you give here at Oasis Home Church. If you give a tithe, which is at 10% uh, every month, thank you for the steps of obedience. If you're just giving, offering above and beyond, or just you're taking those steps of just bit by bit, I would just encourage you to continue to be faithful. And as God invites you into more steps of generosity, hey, trust him in that, right? Choose humble obedience. Because again, God is honored in our humble obedience. There are lots of ways that you can participate in generosity here at Oasis, whether that's right there in your home church today. You can also mail that in to here to the church. We have little offering envelopes that you can mail in, as well as you can give through our website, www.oasishomechurch.com. However you choose to engage with generosity, thank you for those steps of humble obedience. of saying, Jesus, I see how you've been generous to me, and I, in response, want to be generous to your mission. Thanks for your faithful giving.